Okay, let's grab these scissors. Grab them. Grab them. These could be of use to me. Mummy's sewing machine. She learnt how to sew because nobody else could do it to her liking. Mummy's medicine. Will they do her any good? Yeah, I have no idea what that is. Oh, uh, someone dropped the wine, huh? Our wine. Daddy is so proud of it. Daddy set up his darkroom here. He doesn't take photos anymore because of his work, but photography is still his true passion. I'm allowed to use the darkroom when I want to. <laughs> Gonna mess this up horribly. All right, a little birdie. Right there should be good. Card out of position. Not a bad photograph. It seems that the camera works perfectly. Now I can take a self-timed photo for Martha's frame.
yeah, definitely gonna have to get used to all that stuff. There are three baths when developing photos. The development bath, then the first rinse, and then the fixing bath. The second rinse is done directly in the sink afterwards. Yeah, I think I'd do a little bit of that when I played uh, the medium. Don't know if I uploaded that to the channel or not. I don't think I did. Right, my objective is now Where do I go to? Frame. All right. Oh, can I sit in that chair and take a photo? Take a look over here real quick. Oh, I'm guessing this chair. I see a tripod right there and nothing else. Camera is set up with the self timer. Are you going to take the camera back or no? Guess not. All right. Let's go develop our picture. Yes, this is me. No one was ever able to tell us apart. But I never had the slightest doubt, and nor did Martha. It's strange how what identifies us most deeply is not visible to anyone. I was obsessively thinking about Martha and what had happened. But suddenly, a thought took control. The memory of that day at the lake was becoming more and more like a dream when, after awakening, the image becomes more and more faded. Could it be that the memories were a figment of the mind? Had I been the one that hurt my sister? I had always envied her and now I had taken her identity. I experienced a suffocating pattern of thoughts. I decided to go straight to the lake to retrieve the film rolls. They would tell a different story, I was sure. But deep down, I kept hoping they would confirm my fading memory. A 
Of course the door is locked. The keys aren't hanging on the lock as usual, then they will be in Daddy's study. We live in fear now. My parents are not going to let me go to the lake anymore after Martha's death. So this is the right time. I need to know. The self-doubt I feel is eating me up. New chapter, all right. July 18th. Everything has changed. I feel like a different person. The best part of me left with Martha. My enthusiasm, my desire to live, and the will to joke around. I find myself alone, left to my own devices, confused with no desire or expectations. I was handling the cameras at the lake and there was a floating body on the water. I don't remember what I was doing before. Yet another memory lapse. That lifeless body was Martha's. My sister. Mummy ran up to me and hugged me thinking I was Martha and that I, Julia, was dead. I didn't correct her mistake and now it's too late. If they find out I have been fooling everyone, I don't even want to think about it. I feel terribly guilty pretending to be Martha, pretending to be deaf. I took the photo for Martha's frame. I know it's too late now, and I felt incredible pain placing the picture. I said goodbye to her forever in that moment. I realized she was gone, and there was no going back. I must do one thing for Martha. I must find out what happened. The partisans couldn't have killed her. That's just ridiculous. Lapo is my friend, and he is one of them. He loved us so much. We know all of them. So it's just impossible. Okay, let's pull that uh, lighter back out. All right, yeah, this is not the study. Got a lot of art. Back downstairs, and this was the room with the casket. Could this be the study? Phone. Oh, now it wants me to take a picture of her in the dark. Can I light some lights in here or no? Well, I see the photo icon, but I don't think I could take a picture of this in, the, in blackness. It's dark and I can't turn on the lights. It's dangerous. I'll need a flash for the camera. I can look for it amongst Daddy's things in the room below his bedroom. So, back downstairs again. But I need to find the keys. Is that a dumbwaiter? Can't tell what it is. It's probably still locked. Oh, three story house. All right. Head over here real quick, though. Phone locked. Locked. All right. Let us turn around, go back this way. So what is that? I can't see it. Here's the camera flash. Now oh. I can photograph Martha even in the dark. Yes, definitely dark. Bulbs. Daddy's stuff. War maps. I've heard everything will play out on this new defensive line. 
So I'm looking over here and I'm seeing this. So I'll be guessing we are the baddies. Yeah. Not good. There's the key. Go to the left. More smokes. All right, let's head back down. Take that picture. Because that, that's not creepy or anything, right? So you automatically just gonna put the uh, bulb on there, or am I gonna be staring into dark darkness? Yes. Yeah. Is there options just so I can see what I'm doing? No. Hmm. In focus, too dark. No kidding, it's too dark. There it is. That's better. Done. It would be nice to have you always by my side, even if it's just a picture. Uh, why not take a picture of her or an old picture where she was living? Why do one with her in a casket? That's just disturbing. So do I have to go What am I looking at? A lens and a roll of infrared film. They can photograph what the naked eye cannot see. With this lens, I can shoot very close up. Blue filter, ideal for indoor photos. Orange filter, when there is fog, it improves the image by giving it some contrast. I'm learning all kind of new stuff today. It's like pitch black. <laughs> All right, so let's do that one. Um, it's really hard to see. A photograph is both the present and the past, like a dead body. I don't know what I'm expecting. Maybe it's silly to think you can capture the soul of someone who has died. Yeah, I'm going to change my settings. This game is way too dark. Her face can no longer tell me if what happened was my fault. I should have known that already. All I can do is head to the lake and get those rolls. <laughs> it's like not even centered. <laughs> Alright, give me a second, guys, to change some settings here.
to iron. All right, not so bad now. Now I'm not, they always tell you to make it like super dark, but then it's too dark. Like right now, it's too dark. Let me pull out the lighter. Okay, where was that door that led to the outside? Oops, wrong button. I don't think it was in there. Not in there. This one? Yep. So can I ride my bike in the dark? Or am I going to be hoofing it? I guess I'm going to be hoofing it. Wasn't the bike over here? Well, it was outside earlier. Before, no, wait. Oh, lantern, right? I am so taking that. Much better. I think the bikes were liked up uh, in the front of the house, behind the gate. Yeah, over there. No such luck. Alright, so which way do I go that way, or do I go the other way? To the lake. I see a river. No lake. Unless I am just blind. Well, uh, nothing to it but to do it. And this gate's locked, so it's probably not the right way. Unless I could take that path down that way. Yep, okay, let's head down this path over here. I came here to fish when I was little. I went with that ever so kind man who worked for my father. Who knows where he is now? Maybe he joined the war too. We'll just follow the river, or stream, hopefully it takes us to the lake. Yep, ever so slowly. What's this? Oh, their camera scan, alright. And the stream just starts from nowhere. <laughs> All right. Kind of feel there should be some water here, but guess not. Am well, I not supposed to be here? Because this grass looks kind of not too too good. Where the heck am I? Yeah, I'm like off the map. <laughs> Crap, I don't think I'm supposed to be here. Do you think they let you, you know, stop you with an invisible wall at some point? Not just walking into oblivion because now everything is going kind of crazy. Yeah, I've definitely hit the edge of the game world here. 
Let me head back. For my game crashes or something. See, yeah, everything is just not rendering out here at all. All right. Oh, dear goodness. What happened? No. No. Am I, am I, am I falling into oblivion? Oh, my God. What is going on? This is terrible. What the hell? Okay. I'm... Yeah, okay. Let me just restart the game, I guess. Uh, hopefully it's going to be that one. So I guess I'll go back, grab that camera, and then head a different direction. So this is where we do the good old-fashioned editing and speed things up or do a nice hard jump cut. Now to find the lake. Look at the map again. Uh, okay, none of that's interactive. Um, shit. Let's head off. Let's see, there's stairs over here. I'm hoping it's down that way. Let's take a peek over here real quick. And nothing. All right. Left or right? Guess we'll try left first. I was afraid of animals when I was little. I never approached them alone. Why is this on? Yep, we know what that is. Yep, it's, it's not going this way. This price is right back up to the house. Yeah, okay, so let's backtrack and head the other way. Okay, that music's getting a little creepy. I love the night, but this night scares me. In the dark, I can feel all the harm I've caused. It's getting closer with each step. I feel it brushing up against me like a cold wind. I hurt Martha. 
The closer I get to the lake, the more certain I am of this. How could it not be? I killed her to steal the love that everyone felt for her but didn't feel for me. How could I have done such a thing? Hard to tell exactly which way to go. Hopefully this is the right way. What the hell? What? Just that way, and then there's a SS helmet. German soldiers. Daddy ordered patrols to be carried out near the house, but how could they have lost a helmet? God only knows. Okay, there's that way, and that, or I can go that way. Or what I could do is look at my map. Okay, so the map does move when I go to a different area. Okay. So I'm going to one of these axes over here, way over here. So I should go left. If I go straight, it takes me to the river. So you want to go left. Okay, I'm starting to understand the map more now and the game world, the controls, all that stuff. Who lit this? No way in hell I got in the woods by myself and no one not uh night like this. Nope, no freaking way. Especially during you know the war. Alright, am I still going the right way? I hate to keep bringing up the map. Yeah, okay, so keep going straight. Uh, uh, let's go straight, straight, all the way straight to that X. Let's see what that's about. Oh no! Damn lamp! Luckily, I still have my lighter with me. <gasps> really? Really, really, really? So that thing ran that way, but the X was over here. Should I go that way? No, it's gonna fly. Let's see what the X is about first. The cameras are somewhere around here. Oh, I guess in the X is the cameras, okay. Two cameras left. What is up there? Is that in the sky? Is that a UFO? What is that? Alright, so we want to get the other ones, and the other one is... I guess I can go through around the dock and walk through the woods, maybe? Let's see if I can. Is that, is that the house way up there? I can't tell. Oh, yeah, here's another one.
one more camera to collect. Oh, it's right there, okay. A shred of fabric here in the woods. How strange. Let's take a photo of it and leave it where it is. That's it. I've got them all. These films are going to help me understand what happened. Now I should rush home to develop them. How could it have ended up here? It looks familiar. Yeah, nice. Now it's not so dark out here. I just I keep hitting the wrong button. Check the map. Oh, I could run across along the beach here. To see if there's anything else I can find. Any more pictures to take, stuff like that. Or is it gonna... Nope, I can go. Alright. Hidden points of interest. Since apparently I can just go anywhere. We're not venture too far just because I faulted the game world again. That was not cool. There. Okay, I did not get rewarded for my exploration. <laughs> I'm gonna just go ahead and stick to the path. If it'll let me. That is a negative. Can't go that way. Alright. Good. some freaky stuff going on. Wait, why am I so short? Am I kid now? Uh... 
Um, is she pregnant? That is just disgusting. This game is a trip. Yeah, is there something I can do here? Oh, no, just watch it? Okay. Oh, yet another nightmare. She entered my dreams once more. Maybe she wants to talk to me. What am I saying? Fairy tales coming true. Yet I feel... No, no, these are the thoughts of a crazy person, and I'm not crazy. You are a little, uh, wet. Ooh. That is a lot of blood. Oh, damn it, what's all this blood? I'm not due yet, and there's a lot more than usual. What's happening to me? Am I going to be joining Martha sooner than I thought? I have to wash up and do what needs to be done. If I'm sick, I have little time. The truth awaits me. It must be hidden within those rolls. Come on. What am I thinking? I would stain my clothes with blood. Well, you can't take them with you to the washroom? Oh, here we go. up there that's better but I still don't understand all of that blood that's never happened to me before but I'm not going to tell my doctor otherwise he'll make me stay in bed and rest yeah that's a good idea just don't tell your doctor you're bleeding that much Well, let's see. If we're bleeding that much, we should probably wear it till dark. This dress is only for special occasions. Fine. It's very rude, but I could pick up the phone and listen to their conversation. Let's be rude. Julia always used to say that. 
Yeah, sure, she used to say they were just friends, but you know too, right? Friends are not supposed to do such things, Father. Or are they? But anyway, you're defending them both. You, my husband, and even the nanny, who, deep down, is a good woman. The nanny? I believe the nanny is the one who hurt Julia. With her evil passion for those cards, they are cursed things. I hope you made them disappear. Of course. I keep them safe in my room. Anyway, you must forgive me, Father. I have to go. They've come to pick me up. Have a good day. You too. Lapo's involved in Martha's death. My mother is losing her mind again. How could anyone even imagine such nonsense? And Don Attilio, he is a great friend, but what a weird view. Those cards are just a game, but most importantly, they're mine. Why on earth did they take them from me? Dad loves these prints of Florence. I find them a bit sad. Following the dramatic news from the countryside, Archbishop Toccarelli will protest with the French in the city for the raping being committed by invading troops. New ordinance for the safety of citizens. From this moment on, it is forbidden for anyone to leave their homes and walk the streets of San Cassiano. All windows, including cellars, house entrances and doorways, must remain closed night and day. The population are advised to stay in their cellars or, where these do not exist, churches and other large buildings. The patrols of German armed forces have orders to shoot at people who are on the street or who are found looking out of their windows. I shall repeat for clarity. New ordinance for the safety of citizens. From this moment on, it is forbidden for anyone to leave their homes and walk the streets of San Cassiano. All 25 ISO film. When the sun is high in the sky, it's perfect. Must remain closed night and day. The population are advised to stay in their cellars or where these do not exist, Judges General Edith K. New rules on curfew and women's behavior. German command of S. Vincenzo Atori. Telephone number 1185. No change there. The radio needs to be kept on at all times these days. It can save your life knowing things on time, especially before they happen.